typing quest request, we can see that we need to go to an area called Mudwog Swamp. Typing run to Mudwog will take us right there. And here we are. We are on the banks of a slow moving river. Having a look at the room description, we can see that the words wade in are in bright red. If we type exits, we can see that the custom exit is also called wade in. That was very nice of the builder to add those extra hints in for us. Let us type wade in. Typing quest info, we can see that we need to go to a drowned man in the vicinity of Mudwog's first wife. I have a feeling we need to go deep into this area, which means we're going to get very muddy. Excellent, my dirt kicking skill has increased. Ah, again, in this room description, we see the words slide down in bright red. I'm guessing this is what the custom exit is for this room. Excellent. Having a look at this room description, we don't see any coloured words. However, we can still type exits. This custom exit is the same as the last one. Oh my, this is an area full of aggro mobs. And I've just gained a level. I am now level 32 and I've got a new skill called Dual Wield. That sounds rather exciting. I can't wait to finish this quest and go check it out. I'm just going to toggle no EXP on so I don't gain any more levels as all these aggro mobs are giving me experience points. Oh goodness, I'm actually blind. No, I can see again. Oh, that was lucky. I couldn't remember what my cure blindness potion was. Or if I even had one. Typing AF shows I'm not actually affected by any skills or spells, which means I rub the dirt out of my eyes a moment before checking that command. Ooh, 
Well, now we need to enter pit. Looks like we're going down and down further into this mud. And here we are, Mudwog's Domain. Oh, and in this very first room I entered in this part of the area is a drowned man. Excellent, let's get out of here before any more mobs attack us. <laughs> 